Hi, I'm Dr. Jeff here again this week with uh, co-host Nanny. Nanny, what's the big topic this week? This week we're going to talk about something fancy. We're talking about Epley's Maneuver. So Epley's Maneuver is a big word. Uh, it's designed for treating something called BPPV, which is uh, benign paroxysmal positional vertigo. It's for those people that get positional vertigo. So it's when you put your head in a certain position, you seem to get vertigo. So you get the dizziness and the spins and it feels like the earth is going around and, and, and you're not. Um, this is coming from your inner ear. Um, what can happen is, uh, in order to triangulate where your head is in space, your body uses your eyes, uh, your neck, and your ear. And they're all sending messages to the brain to try and tell your brain where your body is in space. And if one of these isn't working right, what can happen is you get vertigo. So in the inner ear, you've got three of these little canals called semicircuit canals. They are semicircular, um, and they have fluid in it. What can happen is in one of these canals, with that please, it's the uh, posterior canal, you get a little, could be a little calculi, or you get a little swelling, uh, allergy season, it may get a little bit of a, uh, inflammation in it. And what happens is the, the, the message isn't going right to the, the brain telling you where your head is in space from this canal, and you get the vertigo. So the whole idea with Epley's Maneuver is they're trying to take this, uh, this calculi, or this swelling, we're trying to move it through the semicircular canal, uh, starting at one end, through different maneuvers, out the other end, to get rid of the vertigo. You can try Epley's Maneuver at home. All you'll need is your bed. So you're gonna have a seat and you're gonna place a pillow on the edge of the bed and lay back so that your head is hanging off the bed about 30 degrees. First step, you're gonna turn your head 45 degrees towards the side that causes vertigo. This position will not be comfortable as you'll be feeling dizzy and nauseous. Hold this position for 60 seconds and then you're gonna rotate your head towards the other side, again, 45 degrees. On this side, you should not feel the vertigo symptoms and hold this for 60 seconds. After 60 seconds, you're gonna roll your body towards that same side so that your face is facing the ground and you're gonna hold this position for another 60 seconds. Again, this position should not cause your vertigo symptoms. After 60 seconds, you'll sit on up and hopefully the crystal has moved through the canal and your vertigo symptoms have decreased. After trying this maneuver the first time, if you experience the symptoms of vertigo again after a couple hours, you can try the maneuver again, but at least can take up to 24 hours to fully resolve your vertigo symptoms. Yeah, and if you're finding at least isn't really working for you, uh, it may be that uh, it's not the posterior canal that's the issue, it may be one of the other canals, and there's different maneuvers for the other canals, for the anterior and lateral canals. So you may want to go to see a health practitioner that, that uh, can test you, because there's certain tests we do that we can determine which canal it is. The posterior canal is the most common one, but you do have two other canals that may be uh, causing the issue and you can get it tested to determine which canal it may be. And there may be other exercises you can do to try and help resolve your vertigo. We hope you found today's video helpful on Epley's Maneuver. If you did, please give this video a like, comment, share with your friends. If you have any questions, feel free to email us. And if you have anything you want Dr. Jeff or I to talk about, feel free to email that to us as well. And as always, here at Goldsway Chiropractic, we, we got, got your back. back.